Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful, perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well, no doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game. Great lead! It's come back out! It's off target and by quite a way. Rashford very nearly made that count from a combination of look and, and good judgment. been intercepted and that will come to nothing Ashmoon needed to come up with a better ball yeah the idea was right the delivery wasn't and Sterling Ivanovic is there and he can get that clear it's anyone's ball he is not one readily to admit defeat don't be surprised if he tries that again well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. Has he found his man? Bruno Fernandes. And here's Rashford. No change to the score. Nil-nil it remains. Bruno Fernandes threads one through. Messi plays it backwards, and they'll try. He's good for it! Goal! Germany! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Germany put themselves into the lead. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender, and he's done it again. Oh, good interception. And it's Sterling. Sterling. He's there to heave it away. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1 0. Hasmoon. Malcolm plays it out to the wing. Sanchez. Luis. Plays it over to the other flank. George. Sterling. Crosses it in. And the finish! This could fall anywhere! First 45 minutes are up. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but that still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up today. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the They work tirelessly for me. Germany come in, having established that lead. A game where the narrative is, at least in terms of the scoreline, so far so good. So we're just settling back into this second half. Germany carrying a one-goal lead. Out to the right. Now can has a hit! Oh, 
it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. A buccaneering run from the defender. Gets up to hit it! Oh, just needed a better contact. So that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Forward it goes. David Luiz. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Semedo plays it out to the flank, and it's Sterling. George. Ball driven towards the far post. It's gone a long way up and away. George. Well, he's definitely kept the side in the game then. That's really good positioning. They could have doubled their lead there. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. And the finish! And with the goal of his mercy, a dreadful miss. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Zenit St. Petersburg making another change here. David Luiz. Still just that single goal and we are nearly done. Gets wrestled off the ball. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Played into the middle. Ivanovic tries to clear. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Germany probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. Coaxed through there. And he just whacks it away. Messi. Germany... Need to hold on for a few more moments. And that will be the final act. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. As you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim. And there's a lot more to read into this game than just the scoreline. Thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.